hey welcome back it's almost a month since i've been able to sit down for my video because of the debacle of the deadly virus we are having it in india in my last video i discussed all the high points in that you need to practice in your morning skincare routine in order to keep your skin protected throughout the day you've already heard of this phrase many a times beauty sleep well this is so apt because this is a time when your skin's performance is at its optimal level it repairs, it regenerates a cell, which is why mechanistically it makes so much of a sense to add uh, active ingredients in your night skincare routine. So are you ready to know what should be your night skincare routine? What are the products you should be using and which ones are right for your skin type? I'm Kavita Deva, a cosmetic dermatologist, skin expert and a consultant for the past 22 years. At night, your main focus should be restoring your skin by stimulating the collagen production. Nighttime provides you with the opportunity to give your skin the best ingredients to repair itself while you are asleep. Your morning skincare routine has those three simple steps, cleansing, treating and protection from the UV rays. Whereas your night skincare routine should also be as simple uh, while following those three simple steps cleansing, treating and moisturizing. So instead of protection from the SPF, here you have changed it to using a moisturizing so your skin. Cleansing and moisturizing you must be quite aware of uh, because there have been many videos and write-ups on it. So I'll talk about it a little later. But what does treating involve? It is an important part of the night skincare routine because it involves the active ingredients like your retinol, vitamin C, peptides, hyaluronic acid, so on and so forth. This is a step which makes a huge difference on the health of your skin over time. So I'm going to list down the night skincare routine with some of the product recommendations. Of course, everyone's skin type, concerns, age are different. So adjust your products, your ingredients accordingly. But remember, skipping your night skincare routine is like depriving your skin from all the nutrients and your actives needed for your skin to regenerate and to restore while you're sleeping. The goal of your night skincare should be to help in promoting the cell turnover and to stimulate collagen production to repair if there has been any damage occurred throughout the day. So going with cleansing as the first step of the night skincare routine is required is essential to uh, do the cleansing thoroughly uh, after the whole day's buildup of dirt by pollution, sweat and makeup. Going with a double cleansing is a great idea firstly because it deep cleanses your pores uh, from oil, dirt and makeup and secondly it also prepares your skin to absorb the active ingredients which you will be using before sleeping. You can use the same cleanser what you have used in the morning but if you are going for a double cleansing you can opt for a gentle cleanser like Missler water for the first wash and then you can go with your regular cleanser. If you are one of those who, cleanse, who likes to cleanse your skin only once a day then nighttime is the perfect time to cleanse your skin to get rid of your dirt, oil and of course makeup. If you have an oily skin, opt for a cleanser which is foam based, uh, which cleans the pores thoroughly. You can use the same cleanser for morning and night. And if you have a dry or sensitive skin, go with more of a gentle and a hydrating cleanser. The second step in a night skincare routine is using toners. Though this is an optional step, but I would suggest try incorporating toners in your night skincare routine as this balances the ph of your skin also there are toners which also helps in brightening and hydrating your skin so now we come to the second step of the night skincare routine treatment treatment is a step where we use active ingredients and it is in the form of serums it delivers concentrated versions of the active ingredients the purpose of using active ingredients can vary from hydrating your skin to brightening your skin, to wrinkle reducing, and also maybe for your spot treatments. Serums are a thin concentrated formulas which allows to treat the skin in a more targeted way than the regular daily routine products. 
this is a step where you should customize your daily routine it should be more tailor made according to your skin concerns and your skin type it is very important to go with the right ingredients ingredients which are packed with by science like your retinol glycolic acid vitamin c your antioxidants and also plant based uh, ingredients like your package use retinol serums for anti aging acne your vitamin c for brightening pigmentation and niacinamide for soothing and hyperpigmentation and if you have a sensitive skin and can't tolerate retinol for anti aging purpose then you can use plant derivative bagatelle instead of retinol next comes your eye cream this is an optional step too Uh, why I'm saying that because the, the creams and serums what you use for your face are just as helpful as your eye cream. There's an ongoing conflict about the efficacy of the eye cream, but you have to remember the skin around your eyes is the thinnest and most delicate, so you have to be extra careful about it. Select your products, your ingredients wisely when you're going for eyes. Uh, use your ring fingers because this this has the least pressure. Instead of rubbing it, just dab the product. Maybe that's the reason why some experts believe in going with the specially designed products for the eye, as the regular product may irritate the skin around the eyes. Try training your skin around the eyes to handle more active products like retinol, vitamin C, to get the most benefit out of your product. And now the last but not the least step of your night skincare routine. moisturization moisturizing is really important at night because it it creates a barrier it seals the active product inside your skin and also keeps your skin hydrated this way when you wake up your skin is more glowy and plumpy and is ready to start the day look for the ingredients which moisturizes your skin like your peptides ceramides hyaluronic acid glycerin uh, niacinamide and if you are looking for more hydration you can also go with uh, the ingredients like jojoba oil your shea butter so at the end i would like to reiterate don't make your skincare routine too complicated to achieve results just stick to your basics follow the golden rule of product application applying the lightest to the heaviest when you are layering your products and keeping your skin regimen simple because using too many products may irritate your skin there isn't one size fits all routine but there is a foundational regimen which everyone should have in place if you have liked my video please give a thumbs up and please do share my videos with your friends and family to like and subscribe my videos because it matters have a happy night skin care routine till then stay safe and i'll see you with my next video bye bye